I'll look at the big picture and where all the rainfall is going to be coming from over the next several days, really all the way on into Thursday. I can see our rain moving through this afternoon, mild, mini low pressure area along a front which snakes its way all the way on into the Gulf of Mexico to our southwest on toward uh, Louisiana. So this is going to provide all the moisture that's going to feed on in over the next several days, all the rain that's going to feed on in. We can see some fairly heavy rain coming up for the day tomorrow, one to two inches, low pressure area. See it spinning with a line of thunderstorms uh, through the region. That's out over the eastern shore and moving away now. Now, this is our future track computer model, uh, which assumes that by 7 o'clock, we've had an inch, inch and a half of rainfall into the area. Now, I think some of these are a little bit overblown. It's too much. I think we've had half to around three quarters of an inch of rain. But I do not doubt that we've had an inch and a half of rain into some places along the peninsula uh, from the earlier rainfall that we had around 3 o'clock in the afternoon. So let's add to this and see where we are overnight. We don't add all that much overnight. I think it'll be just widely scattered rain through 7 o'clock. But once we get into the day tomorrow, yeah, we're going to add some rain. Uh, it was an inch and a half, and now we've added almost another inch and a half of rainfall into the region for the day tomorrow. And into tomorrow night, we'll likely see some more rain, perhaps another half an inch of rain into Wednesday morning. Let's see what we add from Wednesday. Look at this, two and a half, three inches of rain. That's within the realm of possibility on uh, all of this uh, when all is said and done. We'll go through the day on Wednesday. We don't see that much rainfall through the region. So basically, it'll be tomorrow during the day into tomorrow night uh, that we see some fairly hefty rainfall throughout the area. We saw have fairly hefty rainfall during the day today, complements of this low pressure area, which is now moving on out away from our area. This front, though, is going to lollygag around and hang around uh, for the next several days. There's where things are by 5 o'clock in the morning, tomorrow morning. Pretty quiet overnight. To, uh, really pretty quiet through 7 o'clock in the morning. But then by 9, 10 o'clock, we see widespread rainfall throughout the area. Again, look at that pocket of heavy rain moves through between around 11 o'clock and 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Another pocket of heavy rainfall at the end of the day as another low pressure area slides on through. Tends to fade on away, uh, but there's where it is. By, there's where things are by 3 o'clock in the morning late tomorrow night. That's Tuesday night, Wednesday morning at 3. Then we get into the day on Wednesday. There's a little bit more rain overnight. Then we get into the uh, day on Wednesday. It's relatively quiet. A couple of scattered showers into the area as this front is still hanging around. That's where things are by 7 o'clock on Wednesday evening. Now, the longer range version of Future Track still has uh, some rainfall into Thursday morning, Thursday evening. And then by Friday, it's pretty well gone throughout the area. So wouldn't you know by Friday, uh, we end up with a little bit better weather. We're coming up on the uh, Memorial Day weekend, by the way, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, long Memorial Day weekend. This is our Sunday. We can see a stray shower or thunder shower into the area at this point. Now, isolated rainfall uh, coming up during the uh, morning hours. Those we are by 7 o'clock in the morning. But by 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock, yeah, we can see some rumbles of thunder and some rainfall throughout much of the day and on into the evening hours. It'll tend to taper off a little bit by 9 o'clock and then pick back up again uh, during the overnight hours. So, yeah, solid rainfall coming up. It won't be all day long, uh, but we will see, again, uh, one to two inches of rain uh, for tomorrow and then on into tomorrow night, becoming more widely scattered for Wednesday, for Thursday. Much better weather coming up for Friday and into the weekend.